हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल क्विक पोइट्री नॉलेज एंड दिस इज मेहजुबीन टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन द पोएम लाफिंग सॉन्ग विच वॉज कम्पोज बाय विलियम ब्लेक सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड वेन द ग्रीन वुड्स लाफ विद द वॉइस ऑफ जॉय एंड द डिम्पलिंग स्ट्रीम रंग्स लाफिंग बाय वेन द एयर डज लाफ विद आवर मेरी विथ and the green hills laugh with the noise of it so this is how the poet starts the poem this is a poem through which the poet invites his other friends the his uh, other friends who are great nature lovers like him he is inviting the rest of the romantic poets and the rest of the people who adore nature he is asking them to come to him and sit with him and enjoy the beauty of the spring season so that is how he starts the poem when the green woods woods means forest he is saying that the woods laugh with the voice of joy when do the forest feel happy the forest feel have happy when they are covered with greenery all around so in the se- spring season the forest have reasons to be happy when the green woods laugh with the voice of joy everything in nature is um, is cheerful is happy is bright is full of radiance and nature is bristling with activity and this is what the poet is trying to convey through this poem when the green woods laugh with the voice of joy with the voice of happiness and the dimpling stream runs laughing by laughing by the stream is also being described as laughing that means the stream is gurgling and it is a gurgle which expresses happiness why because the stream is full of waters and the waters are uh, creating a, a gorgeous sound while it is moving around while it is moving down it is while the stream is uh, passing through the middle of the forest and the dimpling stream the word dimpling it comes from dimple and dimple is a, a kind of uh, uh, you can say um, it's a crease on the cheek of people uh, when they laugh so in order to show that the stream is laughing with the rest of nature the poet is describing the stream as dimpling now the poet says when the air does laugh with our merry wit wit means um fun humor so when the air does laugh with our merry wit when human beings uh, make fun when they are joyful when they are happy when they are cheerful at that time the air resounds with uh happiness and the air also seems to be making some kind of sound to express the happiness of human beings to express the happiness of the rest of uh nature the birds animals trees forests streams everything so when the air does laugh with our merry wit and the green hills laugh with the noise of it so the hills which are covered with green trees the hills also appear to be happy they also appear to be laughing and cheerful and the hills also um, reflect that noise the noise that is created because of the beauty of the spring season and also because everybody in the spring season including the human beings everybody is happy when the meadows laugh with lively green and the grasshopper laughs in the merry scene when mary and susan and emily with their sweet round mouths sing ha ha he when the meadows what are meadows meadows are large uh, open grasslands and uh, especially in the countryside area the meadows are the places where uh, people uh, let their sheep and goat out for grazing so when the meadows laugh with lively green in the spring season when the whole of nature is happy the meadows which are full of tall grass the meadows also have reasons to express their joy and happiness because they are full of fresh green le- uh, f- uh, fresh green grass so when the meadows laugh with lively green 
that is the green grass when the meadows are uh, happy because of the abundance of green grass all over it and the grasshopper laughs in the merry scene the grasshopper another uh, it's an insect it is also very happy because uh, it is enjoying the beauty of the uh, season and the grasshopper laughs the grasshopper also makes some noise it makes some sound and it uh, in order to uh, express its joy and when Mary and Susan and Emily now the poet is talking uh, about three uh, countryside girls uh, they are nature lovers and they are also very happy and uh, because they are happy they are opening their mouths to express their happiness with their sweet round mouths they sing ha ha he so these three girls maybe they are friends and they have also come out they are no longer indoors they are outdoors and they are um, uh, like together all the three of them they have come out and they are singing to express their joy their uh, to express their happiness to express how thrilled they are because of this changing season so when the meadows laugh with lively green and the grasshopper laughs in the merry scene when mary and susan and emily with their sweet round mouths sing ha ha he now you can see that the poet is trying to talk he's he's expressing he's going to express something else in the third stanza and these uh, the first two stanzas um, they are they set uh, into motion what is going to happen next what is what does the poet actually want everybody to do what does the poet want his romantic friends to do uh, this he is going to express in the third stanza and then you will be able to understand the meaning of the poem in a much better way so let's come to the third stanza When the painted birds laugh in the shade, where our table with cherries and nuts is spread, come live and be merry and join with me to sing the sweet chorus of ha ha he. So what is a chorus? Chorus is a, it's a part of a song that is repeated by a group of singers. So you can see ha ha he is repeated uh, several times here. So when the painted birds laugh in the shade, the birds in nature, the birds fluttering about, are being described as painted. Who has painted these birds? These birds have been painted by God, the universal creator. So this first line of the third stanza reflects the poet's intense belief in God, his immense faith in the creator. And he says, that when the painted birds, the colorful birds, who got those, uh, uh, who gave these colors to the birds? God gave these colors to the birds. And when the painted birds laugh, the birds twitter, they chirp, they in order to express their joy while they are enjoying the um, spring season. When the painted birds laugh in the shade, when the birds sit in the shade of trees when they and um, maybe they are sitting inside their nest the birds chirp the birds twitter and uh, they express their joy at that time the poet also says that this is the time when the poet has set the table maybe beneath those trees where the birds are uh, uh, twittering about where our table with cherries and nuts is spread our the poet is talking about himself and his group of friends who have been invited to uh, sit with him and uh, have a feast where our table with cherries and nuts is spread so he has spread the table uh, with uh, cherries and nuts all picked from the surroundings maybe and where our table with cherries and nuts is spread cherries and nuts are available in nature during the spring season and so let's celebrate with the uh, like with uh, with the fruit of the seasons uh, where our table with cherries and nuts is spread come live and be merry so he's asking his friends come live come have fun come out of your ho houses come out of your homes 
enjoy the outdoors it's a beautiful moment so come live with me uh, enjoy the uh, beauty of the great outdoors and be merry have fun and be merry be joyful and join with me that means team with me celebrate with me i have laid down i have arranged a party for you i have arranged a feast uh, feast for you all all my dear nature lovers so let's unite and let's have fun and at the same time while we are sitting together and enjoying the cherries and nuts we will also uh, sing we will all unite together we will unite and we will sing the so uh, sing the chorus ha ha he that means we will also laugh together and enjoy the beauty of the season thanks a lot for watching let me know if you have got any questions a video containing the paraphrase of this poem will be uploaded very soon consider subscribing to my channel and uh, would you like me to make a video on any other poem of uh, william blake please let me know in the comment section meet you again very soon bye